In 2010, I had just joined the church fairly recently, and we were coming up on the Giving Sunday. And I really wanted to, you know, give a substantial offering, and so I had saved up $500, and I used that as, you know, the basis for my Giving Sunday offering. Uh, as we're going through and we're getting ready for the 2013 Giving Sunday offering, what I wanted to do, I wanted to give more than I had given, you know, before, because I was believing God for, you know, more now. I didn't know where I was going to get it from, whereas before, the $500 I saved it up, uh, you know, systematically, now I had more obligations, and I didn't even know if I could give $50, so I was trying to figure out a way to make that happen. And I told God, you know, I don't know what amount you want me to give, but that whatever it is, I want it to be substantial. I went to church on Sunday. Pastor Evan, he had, you know, he was just talking. He said it would be a great goal if everyone gave a thousand dollars. And immediately I heard it, and I said, God, that's exactly what I want to give. I want to give a thousand dollars, but I don't have fifty dollars to give. And so I, I told God, if you give it to me, I'll give it. Next thing I know, it was maybe not even a week later, I was doing my taxes and looking through the different documents. I, I knew what my taxes should be. I already had plans for that money and I realized that there was a document that I kept overlooking and as I was looking, you know, through the records, you know, the Holy Spirit just told me again, look at it and add the numbers up. Once I did that, my, my tax refund increased by $1,000. And I was super excited and I was planning that money too. And then the Holy Spirit reminded me what I had said to God in church. He said, you know, you told God if he gave it to you, you would give it. And that's what I did. And so before I could be tempted to do anything else with that money, I, I went online to the website, went to the, you know, click the give button and I gave to the Project 360. I put a note on the, on the transaction to let them know that that was for Giving Sunday 2013. I'm thinking everything's great, then I go, you know, to church and Pastor Evan gets up and he gives the testimony of one of our members who had asked God for a thousand dollars and God had given him the thousand dollars and he was holding it and saving it to be able to give, you know, for Giving Sunday and when Pastor Evan was giving that testimony, I remember thinking, gosh, I would love to be able to stand up on Sunday, you know, hold my offering in my hand, give the confession and go down and, you know, give my offering. But I had already given my thousand dollars and you know the next thing I know I hear myself saying well God if you give me another thousand dollars I'll give that too and so I was thinking what are you saying <laughs> but that is what you know what happened and so it could have been maybe a week or two after that because it was still in February I had been negotiating with my with an insurance company over a car accident and we could never, we could not reach them. And it was heavy negotiations back and forth. And all of a sudden, we were able to come to an agreement. And the money that I got from that insurance settlement, I was able to pay off my car. And I paid tithes off of the increase. After that, I'm able to use my car payment to now give the next thousand dollars on Giving Sunday. God really just worked it all out.